Hello, how to solve this is negative 15 to the power of n equals 15. Solving for the value of n that satisfies this equation. So, this negative 15, I can simply have it as negative 1 times 15 raised to the power of n. And this equals 15. So, from here, what I can do will be to apply this identity. If you have a times b raised to the power of c equals a power c times b power c. So you have negative 1 power n times 15 power n equals 15. So from here, what I can do will be to apply this identity. If you have e power i times power n plus 1, this equals 0. We have e power i times pi equals negative 1. Moving this over here. So we can replace this negative 1 here with e power i times pi this is raised to the power of n times 15 power n equals 15. Now if you have a power n raised to the power of n this equals a power n times m so we multiply this out that means you are going to have e power i times pi times n times 15 power n equals 15. Now at this point what we can do will be to apply natural law of natural law of e power i times pi n times 15 power n equals natural law of 15. And if you have natural law of a times b equals natural log A plus natural log B. So from here, I have natural log of, this is e power i times pi, and then plus natural log of 15 power n equals natural log of 50. Remember, if you also have natural log of x power y, this equals y times natural log of x. So we have i times pi n times natural log of e. Then we have plus n times natural log of 15 equals natural log of 15. So from here, is eliminate this. So you have i times pi n plus natural log of n times natural log of 15 equals natural log of 15. This n here, this n here I can factor this out. So I have n times i times pi plus natural log of 15 equals natural log of 15. So isolating n, I divide this by i times pi plus natural log of 15. I divide this by i times pi plus natural log of 15. So from here, this cancel this. What I'm going to have will be n equals natural log of 15 divided by i times pi plus natural log of 15. So guys, this is our value for n. Now let's solve this using a different approach. Negative 15 to the power of n equals 15. This, I can have it as negative 1 times 15 to the power of n equals 15. Then, if you have square root of negative 1, this equals i. Taking the squares of both part of this, then the t discounts with this, negative 1 equals i power 2. If that is the case, I need to replace this with i power 2. I have i power 2 times 15 to the power of n equals 15. 
I can then apply the mantra lock, uh, mantra lock of I power 2 times 15 raised to the power of n equals mantra lock of 15. Now, if you have mantra lock of A than B, or let's start with this, okay, this equals natural log of A plus natural log of B. And also, if you have natural log of A power B, this equals B times natural log of A. So that means, applying this rule here, I'm going to have N times natural log of I power 2 plus natural log of what? 15. I think I'm even fast in order to use this. Now, let me explain something here. This is my A. This is my B. I've made use of these two identities right here. This is my A. This is my B. So my A is this, my B is this. That's why you have natural log of A plus natural log of B making use of this. Then, I made use of this in which the end here comes behind the natural log. So that leaves the end here and this equals natural log of 15. So from here, let me write it here, n times natural log of 5 power 2 plus natural log of 15 equals natural log of 15. We can also apply this identity here, that means we have n times 2 natural log of i plus natural log of 15 equals natural log of 15. So to solve for n, I need to divide this by 2 times natural log of i plus natural log of 15 and also divide this by 2 times natural log of i plus natural log of 15. This cancel this. So what I'm going to, I'm going to have is simply n. And this equals natural log of 15 divided by 2 times natural log of i plus natural log of 15. If you compare this solution here with this but a solution, which is n equals natural log of 15 divided by this is pi i pi plus natural log of 15. Now, if you compare these two solutions, you'll notice that this is two natural log of i. We have two natural log of i, and which is the same thing as i times pi. Two times natural log of i is the same thing as i pi, i pi. That means this and this are the same thing, which is the difference between these two solutions. So guys, if 2 times natural log of i equals i times pi. That means this and this are obviously very correct. So guys, this is it. Thank you and goodbye.